Hey everyone, Andy here. Uh, as you may know, here at Able Cine, we offer a variety of workshops on DIT and engineering topics. Workshops like scopes, uh, look creation, data management, etc., uh, that we offer both in person and online. And during those classes, those workshops, we get a lot of questions about the pieces and parts of a DIT card itself. What goes into it? How does it function? What's that thing doing there on set? So I wanted to create this web series uh, to help you get through the pieces and learn about that. So I put this very elaborate cart together, as you can see here, and I want to step through the sort of functions and, uh, and, and form uh, of a DIT cart. I've broken this down into several pieces, uh, the first section being on the physical components, the cart itself, the cases, power, et cetera, with a focus on these innovative carts, which we see here. Uh, next up, we have a section on video distribution, the ins and outs of the system, literally sending video in and out and routing it around and into my computer and out to various sources. Uh, up to, after that, we have a section on uh, scopes. So we have scopes here from Blackmagic and Leader, as well as the uh, Odyssey 7Q with a focus on that. After that, we have a uh, color management section, which is on the hardware and software used to create lookup tables on set with a focus on Fuji's IS Mini. And then finally, we have a section on data management focused on card readers, RAIDs, LTO backup, etc. So tons of pieces and components to this system, a lot to talk about, so lots of pieces. If you watch my web series online the on, on, on DIT topics, then this will be useful, but it's also good for anybody who's just interested in this kind of thing. So stay tuned for the videos, and we'll see you soon.